It was risky for you to click on this video because you probably aren't ready for the secrets I'm about to tell you about increasing your vertical jump. And it all starts with your elastic bunnies. Any athletic movement you do will use your body's elastic bunnies. When you jump, you always bend down at first, and the movement of going down forces your calf muscles to contract. All the energy your calves store when contracting gets sent down to the back of your foot slash your heel bone. Your elastic bunnies, better known as your Achilles tendon, starts to build tension thanks to the movement. With this tension, your Achilles tendon stores elastic energy within itself, turning it into a spring. Just like a spring when you release and start going up into the air, your Achilles lets off all that energy helping you to jump high. Next learn about the most important thing, your fast twitch muscle fibers and RFD. Fast twitch muscle fibers are the muscles in your body that contract quickly and generate a high amount of force over a short period. When you jump, the force required to lift your body comes from these fast twitch muscle fibers, which contract rapidly to propel you upward. RFD refers to how quickly your muscles can produce force when activated. High RFD means that your muscles can generate a significant amount of force in a short amount of time. This is crucial for jumping because you need a rapid burst of force to push yourself off the ground and overcome the force of gravity. When you combine the activation of fast twitch muscle fibers with a high RFD, you can produce a powerful and explosive jump really quickly making you do stuff like this. Exercises such as plyometrics, explosive weightlifting, and sprinting can be beneficial for improving RFD and your muscle fibers. Next is your body's athletic base. Your core muscles are your abs lower back and hip muscles. These muscles play a vital role in stabilizing the body and transferring force during a jump. A strong core allows for efficient force transfer from the lower body to the upper body making you jump higher. The core muscles also provide stability and balance allowing for a more controlled and explosive takeoff. The abs help stabilize the spine and pelvis preventing excessive movement during the jump. The lower back muscles such as the erector spine assist in maintaining proper posture and spinal alignment ensuring efficient force Force transmission. Also, the hip muscles are essential for generating power and controlling hip extension during takeoff, making you jump higher. And with that being said, if you want to jump like John ja Morant, click on this video.